Welcome to the channel of Coach and Rathi. Today is Sunday, 30 April, our Pink Sunday. Footwork in table tennis is extremely important. Footwork is the key of table tennis. Today, we discuss the Chinese philosophy about footwork. Many amateur players don't know how to move correctly. They just stand at the same position or just move after hitting the ball. This way, they will never improve. Today is the first video about how to do the quick and precise footwork in table tennis. Many players ask me about the footwork. He asked, do the footwork of the great Chinese player is great because they always make a little charm after making a shot. Another player asked, what is the best way to improve the footwork? A lot of people show videos about leg strength conditioning and agility moving fast. However, I have noticed that I did these for a while and my footwork was still slow and the same. However, some new coach told me that the best way to improve it is by getting the movement correct and the coordination correct also. Move, stop and hit. And after you have mastered this moving slow with the footwork real, you increase the speed of the movement. Now I am still doing this and I have noticed that my footwork is getting a bit better. It is true. And I answer, it is true, it is called the footwork pattern. So today we will learn about the footwork pattern. He said, thanks. And I also noticed some big difference now in my footwork. It is not necessary on how fast you can move and how physically good you get in the beginning. It is about getting the movement correct and after doing the footwork reels faster maintaining the good movement and coordination. I also, I have also seen fat people with good footwork comparing to someone with good physical condition and skinny that doesn't move well at all. He get unbalanced really quickly. You can see that footwork is the big question of many of you. Without the good footwork, you can't get into the optimal position. You can miss the ball, make many unfox errors. However, with a good footwork, you are always balanced and can hit faster, stronger and sooner. So footwork is the key of any stroke technique in table tennis. Footwork is the first thing you need to improve because it will improve the quality of your shot. It is also the key of the concept power from the round and hit by the leg in Chinese philosophy. The first thing you need to change to improve your footwork. You should change the way you put your weight on your leg. I still remember during my journey in China, I have asked a Chinese coach, how can you spot identify quickly who is a good player in table tennis? He answered, easily, just look at the way he moves. To move correctly, you should move on your toe, but not on your heel. Look at the way how Zhang Zhiko moves and put his weight. He always moves on his toe and the heel is up high. Many amateur players do the wrong technique. All of the weight is put on the heel, so the feet is flat and stuck to the ground. No, don't do that. Change it. Put all of the body weight to the toe. Lift the heel, don't let it flat and stuck to the ground. This is the best way and the quickest way to move in table tennis. Why Chinese players are so strong in footwork? In Chinese philosophy, footwork is not only the way the foot moves to make you get into the position. Footwork is also the way you incorporate your body, your hip, your waist, your shoulder, before and after you hit the ball. So footwork is not only for the leg, but is also the whole body. You should understand that footwork is the work of the whole body. Before hitting the ball, the good footwork will make you get into the best position which allow you to use the power of all of your body to hit the ball. That's, that is why the quality of the shot of the Chinese players are very good because they have the best footwork in the world. After hitting the ball, the good footwork will get you into the position quickly 
so you will never unbalance and can counter attack in the next shot. I would say that the footwork is the key why Chinese players always dominate the rallies and they are so fast. This is the super shadow play performed by 31 different age young players at 18 table at Shanwei Table Tennis Club in Beijing. The way this kid trained the footwork is so natural. They incorporate the movement of the legs, the hip and the body into the shot. At a young age, this training is crucial because they will memorize quickly this fundamental movement and develop their technique later. If you are not young and already have a bad habit, it is harder to change, but it is never late. Forget all of your technique and train from the zero. Learn this fundamental movement step by step. Repeat it every day. This is the only way if you really want to improve your technique. Remember the 10,000 rule. To master any skill in, in the sport, you need at least 10,000 hours of repetition and training. In Chinese philosophy, there are two aspects that you need to improve your footwork, quick and precise. I will explain to you right now what is the best way to train to be quick and precise in footwork. How to train to have quick footwork? There are many reels to train footwork, but this training lot of reels is the best way to improve the agility of your footwork. You should do this reel every day in your daily basics. It takes only 5 minutes with 7 exercises, but your level will increase rapidly. Exercise 1. Step forward and backward training. You should do this at your table tennis club with another player every training session. Each exercise is repeated 2 times. It takes only 5 minutes. Exercise 2. Keyboard step. Repeat these reels to make your foot faster and lighter. Exercise 3. Lateral jump. Exercise 4. Twisted. Exercise 5. Jump back. Exercise 6. Small step. Exercise 7. Relax. How to train to have precise footwork? As I explained in the beginning, there is the best way for the footwork movement. It is called the footwork pattern. This pattern is the method to move and position your feet for each type of stroke. To have a precise footwork, you need to learn this pattern. There are many types of stroke, forehand attack, forehand drop shot, quick flip, forehand to backhand transition, backhand top spin, backhand push, backhand chop, backhand two point attack, pivot step around, forehand smash, block push, block sideways position. But in general, there are only four main footwork patterns that you need to master. In the next video, I will explain the four most important footwork patterns in table tennis that every player should learn. I will upload these full footwork reels if you want to repeat in your daily training. That's it for today. See you, Coach and Bradley.